Hello my friends, welcome to Top Classical Music. Today we will present a short biography about Francesca Caccini. Francesca Caccini, born in 1587 in Florence, Italy, was a remarkable composer, singer, and instrumentalist of the Baroque era. She emerged as one of the most influential female musicians of her time, leaving an indelible mark on the history of music. Coming from a family of musicians, Francesca Caccini's musical education began at an early age. Her father, Giulio Caccini, a renowned composer, provided her with extensive training in voice, composition, and various musical instruments. Francesca's talents flourished under his guidance, and she quickly gained recognition for her exceptional musical abilities. In 1607, Francesca Caccini joined the prestigious Medici court as a singer and composer. Her role expanded beyond mere performances, as she also took on important responsibilities as a music educator and administrator. She composed numerous vocal works, including operas, madrigals, and sacred music, which showcased her lyrical and expressive style. Caccini's most celebrated work is her opera La Liberazione di Ruggiero dalla Sola di Alcina, The Liberation of Ruggiero from the Island of Alcina, which premiered in 1625. This opera, notable for its rich harmonies and emotional depth, solidified Caccini's reputation as a skilled composer and contributed to the development of the emerging genre of opera. Beyond her compositions, Francesca Caccini's virtuoso singing and instrumental skills were highly revered. Her proficiency with the lute and harp, among other instruments, added a unique dimension to her performances. She was known for her expressive voice, capable of conveying a wide range of emotions, captivating audiences across Europe. Despite her immense talent and achievements, the gender biases of the time limited Francesca Caccini's recognition. However, her contributions to music endure, and she stands as a symbol of perseverance and artistic brilliance for generations to come. Francesca Caccini's legacy extends beyond her own compositions. She also taught music to her sisters and daughters, ensuring that her musical heritage would continue. Her influential treatise Il Primo Libro del Musiche, the first book of music, provided valuable insights into performance practices and musical theory of the time, further cementing her role as a leading figure in the Baroque music scene. Francesca Caccini's life and work serve as an inspiration to aspiring musicians, especially women, encouraging them to overcome obstacles and make their voices heard in the world of classical music. Her compositions continue to be studied, performed, and cherished, reminding us of the enduring power of music and the remarkable talent of this pioneering composer. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.